What up, movie disciples? Back at it with another reaction. And I, I don't know if you've seen him before, but if you haven't, this is Cuzzo, aka Kenfolk. He doesn't have any Instagram or anything like that for me to put up. Yeah, he's back at Mondays and decided to hop on and do another reaction. Now, this video, I didn't realize how old it was, but this dude doesn't put out, I guess, that much content. He goes by the name of Mighty Raccoon. And I have another reaction coming up soon, you know. But I decided to hop in and react to this one because I'm a fan of Marvel and Kratos. And Ken Folk is definitely a fan of Kratos. That's what we used to get down on when he was in college. He was playing a lot of God of War. That was the day, oh, baby. Exactly. That was the joint. So I, I saw it and I was like, yo, who else than to watch and react to this video with than the man, the myth himself, Ken Folk. So that's what we're about to react to. How you feeling, Ken Folk? Feeling good, man. Just took a nap. Like some nachos or some powdered donuts, I'm in there. That's that's how I come in. But all right. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, do you, player? Do you? All right, you better uh, hop in. Before we do, though, make sure you like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Uh, also, follow us, or follow me on Instagram and Twitter and social media. Okay, all right. At the at the warning up there, some blood and shit. I like it. I like it. Mighty Raccoon. What a name. There's so many thoughts when I see that. <laughs> a lot of questions pop up like. Yep. <laughs> Interesting name. What is that? Like a symbiote. This one from God of War, I can't remember. Yeah, isn't that be from four? Yeah, this is from four. Ah, see, that's all. I ain't played it. I ain't played it. My girl has though. He's old, got a beard. Thunderstorm in two seconds. Not looking good. Enter God of Thunder. Who got that Stormbreaker with him, boy? I know this looks pretty good. Not gonna lie. Oh, you. <laughs> Thor, <laughs> yeah, I'm son right. of Odin. I heard you are the god of war. Pretty good graphics. Right. God of Thunder's looking for yeah, a challenge. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> you do not want this fight. Oh, I'm pretty sure I do. You have to be to swing the axe like that, <laughs> right? This music kind of epic too. What? This is your last chance. Stay back. Right? 
with the chest. Oh, you'll do it. It's not good. You know, my man can fly though. Like Kratos is fire, but Snake Thor be flying. Let's say I'm gonna levitate him real quick. Like crazy thing is, like he levitated like Zod did. <laughs> Remember when Zod first like started levitating? He did it all slow and sinister. <laughs> right. Oh, he figured it out. <laughs> man, it's still low key. My top ten. That's one of the best Superman movies. In my opinion. People, people be sleep on it. They don't they don't know, man. This ain't looking ain't looking for good Kratos. Oh he got the chains back. No what's up. Fight. <laughs> Nobody out with their cell phone talking about world star. <laughs> I'm, I'm like, can you imagine watching somebody getting their ass with somebody? He just getting their ass with somebody pound on his chest. I'm like, hey man, you won. Stop. It's the same thing, man. Because I can't watch oh, it. Matter of fact, I would ruin Because I'd be like, this dude does not care. At all. At all. <laughs> okay, he didn't die. He didn't die. He didn't die. Wow. That was uh, some good voice acting by those dudes. That was some very good voice acting. That was damn good. And I, I found out there was a part two, so we'll have to react to that soon. I, I didn't know how good it was gonna be. I mean, I saw it had a lot of views, but sometimes when we get a lot of views and stuff don't be hidden. Even though I've heard this dude's name for a while, I feel like I might have reacted to something a long time ago. All right, Coon, I see you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, Coon, cool. you're killing it. That does, not, that does not give you right to say that Mighty Raccoon. Your name is Mighty Raccoon. We're calling you Coon because we can. Good little fight, Coon. I like that. <laughs> Where are you going for anyone? Where are you going for Kratos over over Thor? I know Kratos. Uh, is good. Uh, or you just want to see a, a good fight? I would have to say I was uh, Kratos versus Thor. I would lean towards Kratos because one, I'm a big fan of Kratos, and two, I kind of feel like Thor is kind of like, mm, mm, really? Mm. <laughs> I mean, you know, he do his thing, but right. I mean, we talking about Kratos, <laughs> like, like who, who's gonna beat Kratos? <laughs> I mean, we just found out, I guess. Kratos is unbeatable, but like I said, it's part two, so I want to see what happens in part two. I, I think maybe next time I will judge you. Maybe we'll judge like a boxing fight. I, I know you're more into boxing and MMA than I am, mainly boxing, but you can you know, maybe score it like who has the edge. You can, you can you know, lead up into it like that. Like, yeah, like who who has better hand speed or something like that. In that case, definitely Kratos. <laughs> I mean, with Thor, you take his magic hammer. I don't know, man. I feel like Thor had, had some quick little handwork. He had, he had good defense and everything. I don't know, man. You're talking about Kratos. This dude went to the bottom pits of hell with nothing. 
or some flip flops. Kill Satan. <coughs> Kill Satan. Killed all the demons. Went back to Mount Olympus. Killed Zeus. All the other gods. Right. With hands. Like, like I'm surprised, you know, Thor was even still alive right then because Savage Kratos, young Kratos, when he was a young book, you know how young books just reckless. He would slice his neck, ripped his head off. You know, he, he a little older, got a beard now. You know, he can settle down that middle age. He settled down, he's like, man, that's enough. But young Kratos in his 20s, college years, oh, man. Oh, he would have just chopped him up. <laughs> That's another thing. We this is old Kratos fighting young Thor. That's another thing. I don't know. I feel like this is season Thor. I feel like young Thor would just came in. He when he when he said no. Well, actually, young Thor would have kept talking shit at the beginning because I just rewatched like the first Thor movie and you know the first one he wasn't you know he was unworthy. He was he trying to be king but he wasn't ready. He was just hella reckless. He was like he came in like. F you Kratos just threw the hammer off rib and like, or he would get a whole monologue for no reason. Like, hey man, this is uh, this is unnecessary. What are we doing here? So <laughs> But no, like, I mean, when I say like young Thor, like he's still young, like, you know, in his athletic prime. Kratos, this man's got a long salt and pepper beard. Like Kratos yeah. at that middle age, you know, he's he don't have that testosterone like he used to. He he's just trying to chill, like I'm trying to get a beer and watch the game. It's like in the middle of the beginning of the fight. Cause like, you don't want this fight, dog. Like, I'm just trying to chill, man. <laughs> Thor is always looking for a challenge. So um, he came to the challenge and he didn't win this fight. So I guess we'll be seeing part two <laughs> relatively soon. I, I wanna, I'm anxious cause the, the CGI was on point. The voices was damn good. And the music was, was pretty damn good as well. So. Mighty Raccoon, you did your damn thing. As far as like the cinematics, it was pretty good. It was very good. If I wasn't a fan already, I'm already, I'm a fan now for sure, Mighty Raccoon. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to check this coon out. <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here first. We're gonna check this coon out soon enough. That does, <laughs> man. Like, we were digging the video. What do you guys think though? Are you a fan of Mighty Raccoon? Have you seen any of his other work? And are you interested if you haven't seen any of his other work? Post your comments down below, like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Follow my dude Kenfolk on we're gonna keep right now we're gonna keep it ambiguous. It's gonna keep it it's gonna pop up on the title. You can follow me though on social media, Twitter, Instagram, all that good stuff. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe to the channel. If you like this reaction, cool. If you didn't, you a hater and you're probably mad because Thor might have lost. Boy, move my side, baseball.